large video today. July 2nd, 2022, opening day cod fishing. It's the Newfoundland Christmas, let's be honest, folks. Going out today, I am bringing back 15 fish. There's no question about it. There's no like, oh, hopefully we get a fish. No, there's 15 fish coming back in, 15 fish getting cleaned, 15 fish getting filleted by me, which I, I'm, I'm terrible at, let's be honest. So I'm out cod fishing today. My dad's boat, it's a 18 foot wooden flat, traditional Newfoundland fishing boat. They call it a Bay of Islands Dory. For those of you watching this not from Newfoundland, our cod fishery or food fishery opens up for about, I think it's 10 weekends a year. It's across the summer. So every weekend for July and August, and then two weekends late September. I might be wrong on that, but it's roughly around there. I'm close. Saturday, Sunday, Monday is considered the weekend. So Saturday, Sunday, Monday, July and August, late September. You are allowed five fish per person, up to a maximum of 15 fish per boat. So three people can bring back 15 fish, five people can bring back 15 fish, two people can bring back 10 fish. One person, five. Now, there's some debate on whether we're allowed more than 15. People are telling me that you're, you're, you're allowed more than 15 if you have more people. I don't know. I'm not gonna risk it. I'm bringing back 15 fish. But if you do know, please inform me. Say, post something in the comments or a link or something because I would love to be bringing back 25 fish every single time. Throughout these videos also, you're gonna see there's things that I don't know much about, like uh, salmon fishing. Zach and Mike, who you'll meet in these videos, they they take it pretty seriously. They're showing me the ropes, excellent teachers. I can't wait to catch my first fish, salmon. So a lot of these videos are gonna be me learning about something, them learning about something. We're definitely not experts. I hope you did not come to this channel looking for experts because I do not know one, let alone am one. A lot of things, fly fishing, filleting fish, cleaning ducks, cleaning moose. I'm getting better at all this. I gotta stop and say hi to my aunt and uncle now. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. I had to stop and say hey. Hey to the aunt and uncle. Anyways, I can't remember what I was talking about. But the moral of the story, the gist of what I'm saying is I'm I'm gonna be learning a lot in these videos. And uh, I'm curious to see the starting point and the end point, a lot of this stuff. I'm gonna start taking a lot more of this stuff seriously because I enjoy it a lot. So this is the starting point of, uh, of a lot of these things for me. Hope you enjoy the video. It's gonna be a good day. Stocks are gone. It's a different way of life, but we'll go on. We face the icy winds and cold out on the northern sea, where the cod stocks made a living once for me. I remember years ago and men. Their daily catch 
With the cod tongues from the heads of fish we'd snatch For a buck a pound we'd all go down close by the water's edge And we wait for skulls to fall down from the ledge And if I stare out long enough over the mist upon the bay I can still see men in the morning sail away I believe I see a vision in my dreams from on this rock Rise from the seas like ghosts out in the fog Now time moves on, our lives did change Some friends will see no more As we boarded yeah. up the windows and the door And we stare once more at an empty shore Where now we're talking. used to race Here's a good one we forgot the tears roll down our face On the way down And if I stare out long enough over The mist upon the bay I can still see men in the morning sail away I believe I see a vision in my dreams from on this rock Rise from the seas like ghosts out in the fog The years they drift behind us and the dreams we have are gone and we realize it's time now to move on Like an ember from the chimney of a wood stove Time that flies And it fades away like stars up in the sky And if I stare out long enough over The mist of the bay Tuna? I can still see men in the morning sail away. I believe I see a vision in my dreams from on this rock. Eyes from the seas like ghosts out in the fog. And if I stare out long enough over the mist upon the bay. I can still see men in the morning and sail away I believe I see a vision in my dreams from on this rock Rise from the seas like ghosts out in the fog They rise from the seas like ghosts out in the fog What's up, guys? Apologize for the lighting here. It's like the sunniest day in Newfoundland history. Um, large day on the water, 15 fish pulled in, just like I said I would. So we cleaned them, now we're gonna cook them. Not all of them, just one fillet. So I'm not gonna do like a traditional Newfoundland fish and chips or pan fried or something like that. You guys know how to do that. I'm gonna throw something different at it. A bit of lemon juice, a bit of Frank's Red Hot Sauce. Just coating the fillets in it. A little bit of Cajun seasoning, some lemon, some dill, and some flour for a bit of a batter. And I'm just gonna put the fillets in here. Move them around. them sit for a few minutes so on the barbecue I like this it's like a blackstone it's a metal plate I leave it on my barbecue I don't know if you can see it blackstone on one side grill on the other it's good for keeping like flare-ups down if you're cooking something greasy in this case I got a bit of oil on the pan so if I didn't have that that flat pan there it's gonna flare up and uh, and it's gonna burn so once these are coated pretty good. I'm just gonna slap them on the grill.
close that lid. So it's been about five minutes. I just flipped them. I'm gonna start to get a bun ready. I'm gonna be making a fish sandwich today. And if you don't toast your buns, I don't know who you are. Throw those right on the grill. Fish is looking almost ready. Another few minutes, it'll be done. Okay, bun's probably ready. Fish looks almost ready. Some toasty buns. <laughs> toasty buns. This is not a homemade tartar. I was not gonna make a homemade tartar tonight. Just a store buy. And a little spicy slaw. Fish is done. A little spicy slaw on top. We got a fish sandwich. My wife's getting half. Sorry, guys. Uh, this was Atlantic cod caught, cleaned, cooked in 24 hours. Uh, it's right out of that water you can't ask for much more than that uh first video i know i'm gonna go back and scrutinize this and i'm gonna notice a thousand things that i should have done differently or could have done better i know i could have talked more about cooking i know i could have talked more when i was fishing cleaning that's stuff i'm working on every video is going to get better and hopefully when i look at our 10th video and our 100th video there's a drastic difference between this one and them but it's the first one if you guys subscribe to this, it helps us so much. It's free for you guys to do. It doesn't cost you anything. And it's a huge support to the channel. It just gets us on, uh, on the top of the list, easier to find for the people that are trying to find us. So thank you again. All Outdoors episode one is a wrap. Time to eat my fish sandwich.